Hey you guys, it's Shirley and welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another video. Today we are going to be doing a updated debt snowball. Before we get started, make sure you go and comment down below, subscribe if you would like to, so you can follow my journey of being debt free. So the last time we did a update was on June 10th of 2019 and we had $29,000. $160.13. Now it is August 15th when I am videoing this, so a lot can happen. Let's just see how we did. Plus, we have new debt trackers. This the link will be down below. It is from like freedebttracker.com or something like that. It's free to print out and everything. So go and check that out if you are wondering where I got these at. I just pick this out because I love to color. Now I'm going to move this aside, but this is what I filmed last time is how much do we really owe. So make sure you go and check that video out. Also, I will be referring back and forth to it through this video. Also, this is my old debt snowball that I wrote down all of my bills and each square equals a hundred dollars. I am still going to color those in because it's literally, it's fun. And plus the student loans, it's not broken up into five different loans. So we are going to still color that in because it's just fun to watch your progress decrease. All right. So I have all of my screens pulled up on my computer that I'm going to be looking back and forth also. So, for student loan number one, which is the Nell Net D, it was $1,277.23. Now, we are going to fill in the, 20, the halfway marks, 25%, 50%, and 75% off, and then we will be coloring some. So, this will be a long video, just to let y'all know. All right, so 25% of the way will be... When I have $957.93, 50% off or 50% of the way will be $638.61. And then 75% done will be $319.31. All right, so hopefully y'all can see that if I need to do a marker I can do a marker it'll probably be nicer so y'all can see but we will do a update so I am go to the loans all right so the total for my student loan D is $1,230.99. So I'm just going to add that and I'm going to subtract it to my beginning balance, which was $1,277.23. And then we will be coloring that in. So minus 277 minus 23 will equals 2. I've paid $46.27. Now each square will be twelve dollars and seventy seven cents all right so we're going to use just these regular old color pencils and we're going to color in so that was forty six dollars all right so we're going to do one twelve that's twenty four Thirty-two. We're just gonna do and then thirty-two. Forty-five. All right, so we're coloring in four amounts. So that's super exciting. Super happy about that. All right, so. Like I said, my balance for student number 10, or student number D, sorry, is $1,230.99. All right, so moving right along for student loan number B, 
so it'll be B. And that was at $1,430.68. All right, same thing. We are going to be doing the halfway marks for this. Each box is going to be $14.30. Twenty five percent of the way is one thousand seventy three dollars and one cents. Fifty percent off is seven hundred fifteen dollars and thirty four. And then seventy five percent done will be three hundred fifty seven dollars and sixty seven cents. All right, so our total for B is. One thousand three hundred and ninety dollars and one cent. So we're going to subtract that from one thousand four hundred and thirty minus minus one thousand three hundred and ninety dollars and one cents will equals to forty dollars and sixty seven cents is how much we actually used. All right, so. We are going to figure out how many squares we are going to color, which I think it's only two, because that will be $38. So we are going to be coloring two squares. And that's going to be like $28. So it is fine. All right. So that is for student loan number, not number, I keep on saying number, for B. So I'm just going to write B right here so people won't get confused. All right, next one is student loan A. And that balance is $2,162.76. So, each box will be $21.62. 25% of the way is $1,622.07. 50% of the way is $1,081.38. And then 75% of the way will be $540.69. Alright. All right, I hope y'all are enjoying this. This will be a very, very, very long video. So just bear with me. I'm just trying to organize my debt trackers and everything like that. All right, so for student loan A, the balance is $2,089.68. All right, so $2,162.00. And 76 cents minus $2,089.68 will equals to $73.08 is how much we have paid off for right now. All right, and then each square, like I said, is $21.62. So it's 21 times 60, $21.62 times 3. So that's 64, so that is probably all we can color in, because 4 is going to be 86. Alright, so we are going to be coloring three boxes. And this is so satisfying, you guys. It really is. All right, so that is student loan A, and we have marked off three. All right, so moving to my credit card loan. I hate credit cards, and I will. This credit card is when I was like 19, and I was approved because I wanted like 20% off or 15% off my total transaction. I know, big 
big mistake. But so for my credit card, that is my like American Eagle card. Each box is $25.33. My total is $2,533.63. In case y'all want to know that. 25% done will be $1,923. Halfway mark will be $1,266.81. And and then 75% done will be at $633.41. Now I'm going to pull up and see how much I have. So my total right now, my balance is $2,442.97. Alright, so we are going to subtract $2,533.63 from... $2,442.97 will equals to we have paid $90.66 since June and each one is $25 so we are going to be coloring three boxes we're going to use blue on this one all right Let me know down below how y'all are doing on y'all's debt snowball. I feel like I am going a little bit slow, which I am. I said August that I'm going to tackle my first student loan, which is my lowest amount. And if y'all have seen my weekly check-in or my cash envelope system, I did say that I was going to put an extra $25, which I did, but I did not update it on my student loan. So this will not be updated on this video. All right, so that is the credit card bill. All right, so for student loan number or letter C, it was balanced $2,812.04. That is my largest student loan. And my balance right now is $2,718.09, you guys. So we're going to subtract that. $2,812.04 minus $2,718.09 equals we have paid off $93.95. And let's see... Let's fill in our little blank space. So, student loan C, each box will be $28.12. 25% of the way will be $2,109.03. Halfway will be $1,406.02. And 75% of the way will be $703.01. All right, so since we paid $23.95, so I'm just going to say $23. Let's see, 28, 12 times 3, that's 84. I think we're just going to be doing 3, you guys. Yep, so we're going to be coloring 3 in. <clears throat> so very satisfying let me know also down below how long have y'all been doing this debt snowball I started in June of last year I paid off one credit card so that was not added to this one I paid off one credit card in December and I thought I was on top of the world and then it hit me. I was not motivated or anything like that. So that's what happened. And now I am struggling to keep up. Which I'm paying the minimum. But I'm just not paying extra I guess you can say. Alright so car loan is my biggest, biggest debt of them all. It is a lease. 
I did not buy it outright. I did not finance it or anything like that. So the balance is $18,943.67, you guys. So $18,943.67. <clears throat> All right, so we are going to, before we get into the new balance, we're going to put in our numbers. So, the car, each box will be $189.43. 25% of the way will be $14,207.76. 50% of the way, which I'm so ready to be 50% of the way, is $9,471.83. And then 75% of the way will be $4,735.92. All right, you guys, let's see how much I have left. So my current balance is from $18,943.67. We're down to $18,070.10. All right, so let's subtract that. $18,070. And 10 cents that is eight hundred seventy three dollars and fifty seven cents that we have paid off since June you guys so we are going to color that so each square is a hundred and eighty nine so and we have eight hundred and seventy three dollars to color so Let's see how much we can do. Let's see, 189 times 43 times, let's do 5. So that's 900. So we are going to be coloring 4 in, most likely. Yes, so we're at 4 is $757. All right, so we're going to color 4, you guys. I hate having a car payment. It sucks. It does, but I've been paying for a car since I was 16. One of them I was it was almost paid off. It was, I think I only had like $2,000 left and then it just it just bit the dust. It was an older model. It was a Lincoln. Absolutely love my Lincoln. And I really want one like really bad that's like my dream car is a Lincoln and I had it and then it was old it was an older version and it just didn't work out so and then after that I had two more cars including this one all right you guys so that is it for this debt tracker all right moving for this debt snowball I'm just going to do this super super quick because it is um, running late the video so we're just going to subtract all of these real quick which is a hundred dollars so American Eagle did we I didn't even write a so each one so we did pay off eight hundred dollars on cars so one two three four five six seven eight All right, and then student loan will come back to it. American Eagle, we didn't do a lot on that one. Let's see. I'm going to pause it, and then I will be right back and get the numbers real quick so we can highlight it. All right, so for the student loans, since June, we have paid off. $253.94. So we're just going to color in two more. And then American Eagle, we're not going to color anything because of it. We only paid off $90. But like I said, I did make a payment yesterday, which I'm going to flip all the way back to this. So my student loan D log on the 14th is $25. And then I'm just going to write the balance, like I said, for loan D so we can keep up 
with the balance for it. So we're just going to write balance and then I'll draw a line um, later on. But the balance is $1,230.99 as of right now. When this goes um, in, then this will go down, but I'm not going to do it until it goes in and it takes about three days. All right, you guys. So that is my video. Let me know down below if y'all enjoyed this video. It was all over the place because I was trying to color in all of my deck trackers, introducing new deck trackers, showing the old ones, and figure out, figuring out all the balances and everything. But I hope y'all enjoyed this. Subscribe, like down below. Let me know if you are doing the snowball also. If you have a channel, let me know also and I will go and check it out. I love supporting you guys. I love getting to know y'all and just supporting and giving advice and everything like that. So without further ado, I will see you guys later. And the next video that you will most likely see is the uh, grocery haul because I'm not getting paid this week. So we're going to do grocery haul and then weekly check-in. And I will see you guys later. Have a blessed week. Bye.